I've got a couple of tips for any junior talent out there that really wants to get noticed by our recruiting team or recruiters, just being very proactive in your search. Hello everyone, my name is Shamara Concepcion. I am a recruiter at ClassPass, now a part of MindBody. Now we'll talk to you a little bit more about MindBody's culture and values and what questions you should be prepared for. Hi, my name is Katie. I'm a recruiter and program manager here at MindBody. In this video, we're going to go over MindBody's application and interview process and give you a few insights on how you can best prepare. The first thing is taking a look at our website, you know, dig around there, get a little bit of insight, check out some YouTube videos, really make sure that you understand who we are as a company and what we do. The next step I would do is um, don't be afraid to cold outreach, you know, take a look at our LinkedIn page, find someone that's currently in that uh, position that you're looking to do, message them, set up a time to speak with them and really gain some insight on a one-on-one -on, -one on, you know, what a typical day looks like, what their journey was to get in that role and future career opportunities. And then from there, be really just Decide that my body is the next best step for you I would encourage you to put in that application from putting in that application reach out to the recruiter on LinkedIn let them know hey I you know have done my research I saw that my body's values really align to mine just being very proactive in your search MindBody will typically have about four stages in the interview process on average. The first, the recruiter will be screening resumes in the system. If they see a candidate whose skills and abilities match what they're looking for in the role, they'll reach out and set up a phone conversation. From there, most roles do have a take-home assessment of some sort. Don't worry, you'll be fully briefed on that before the recruiter sends it over. Once that's completed, the recruiter will touch base with the hiring team. If they decide to proceed, then and the hiring manager will get set up with a 30 minute Zoom interview. If the hiring manager decides to move to the final interview, that will be a Zoom interview with the rest of the team that the role is going to be interacting with. And remember, these are a great opportunity for you to learn as much about the team as possible as well. So don't be afraid to ask questions and learn the team dynamic so you can get a good feel for it. When you get asked questions about your skills and competencies, I would say the more specific the examples you're referencing, the better. Most of the questions at MindBody are going to be behavioral in nature. Don't be afraid to pause and take a beat to think about a relevant example that you're referencing. I would also recommend trying to draw on a diverse range of examples from past experiences. That shows that you're versatile and have a really diverse range of skill sets that you can bring to the table. So what do I look for in candidates? I would say personality. We are a people first organization. And so I want to know that you want to be here. You want to make friends and you're excited to be here. Another thing is authenticity. We really want you to be authentic. Stay true to who you are and not just say what the recruiter wants to hear, but really deep dive into those questions in the interview process and interview us as a company as well. Another thing is aligning to our mind body core values. Now you may not line to all of them but as long as you're able to speak to a few of them in the interview process that's also extremely helpful Diversity and inclusion has long been a priority here at MindBody. We have a very robust DEIB program, which stands for diversity, equity, inclusion, and belonging. We also have employee resource groups, or as we like to call them ERGs, MindBody API, MindBody Accessibility, MindBody Black Alliance, MindBody Pride, MindBody Sustainability, MindBody United, MindBody Veterans, and MindBody Women's Collective. So if a candidate makes it to a final interview, we give them the option to meet with a member of an employee resource group of their choosings. Hiring managers and us as recruiters, we understand that not everyone is gonna, you know, check every single bullet point, but I would encourage you to apply, especially if you align well to our mind, body, core values, which is ultimately what we're looking for the most. So good luck. Thank you all so much for taking the time to watch. I hope this has been helpful. I wish you all the best on your job search.